इतनी कड़वी है आई जस्ट शो यू दैट समथिंग रियली स्पेशल Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today is the second day. We slept at around 9:30 in the night and uh, literally dozed off because I think we were jet lagged and got up early in the morning which was around 6:30. Right now it is almost around 11 o'clock and we have to head out. But there are few things that I wanted to let you know. So when I closed the vlog yesterday, Raghav insisted that we go out otherwise it will be like severe headache in the morning because of the jet lag. So thank God I listened to him. So we We went to do a lot of stuff. So first things first, we got ourselves Presto card. You get it from uh, Shoppers Drug Mart here. I mean, there are lots of stores of this uh, brand around Toronto, so you can get your Presto card from there. I know how intimidating it is when you're new to the country and learning new things on everyday basis. Yesterday also, we were trying to wrap our head around this Presto card thing, but it is not that difficult. So I will try to quickly break it down for you. So what you do is while entering. Entering a subway or the bus, you tap your Presto card for once, and it gives you validity for free transfer within two hours within Toronto, and you will not be charged again. So it is quite easy to use, and I am trying to use it on everyday basis. I mean, it is already second day for us, so we are going to go and take the bus from our station here near our building, and from there I'll go to subway. So I'll be tapping the Presto card here only, and when I reach the subway station i'm just going to tap my presto card there and it is going to give me free transfer so i think it is easy i have quickly taken a shower and i'm waiting for raghav to get ready i'll also go and get ready and catch up with you because i need to discuss about one of the most important document that you need while you are in in canada i'm still saying in india um so i'll catch up with you soon Hi guys so I'm ready yesterday we clocked in around 11000 steps so it is very important i wear comfortable clothes because we have to run errands so raghav let's go yeah i'll just take 5 more minutes and you'll join us in the lobby sure okay going to give you an update about his covid test so generally what happens is shoppers drug mart here it takes the test for you and it directly sends it across to the government i'm kind of liking the vibe of this entire leathery look of this lobby anywho we are going to talk about raghav's covid test yesterday like i said we went and you want to share your experience Yeah so uh, I had to go to the shoppers drug mart to get my covid test done it didn't take long because uh, there were not many people for the test so I was there for about 20 minutes uh, so they just took my swab test and uh, they said the result will be And he came with a very horrible face you yes. know <laughs> it, it was not that bad <laughs> uh, I mean we've all experienced that so yeah, yeah. Um, so the results will be there in about 48 hours uh, in the email so I'm hoping it's negative It is going to be negative. Yeah. Don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> so we are heading to bank right now. Uh, yeah, we are going to Scotia Bank, and we will get our formalities done there. And after that, we will discuss with you what all we did, and I'll catch up with you. So we are out, and like I said, it is day two. We are going for an appointment with Scotia Bank. It is going to be very boring stuff. I find banking very, very boring, but I know it is very important. So let's go and get it done. But for now, we are in the shadow of the building because it is really, really sunny and it is like on your face. And what do you think about it? I know it's on your face right now, and you may <laughs> not be feeling very pleasant about it. But yeah. darling, let me tell you something. You're going to miss this too because winters are coming. Oh, that reminded me of that series on HBO. Uh, I forgot the name, but I really loved it. Game of Thrones. Yeah, it was Game of Thrones. Yeah. Winter is coming. I loved it. So let's get going, and I'll catch up with you after that. Before we head to the bank, I just want to tell you something very cool that I really like here. So I don't know if you can see. You just have to press this button. <clears throat> It's so hard. Now can you help? Jack's coming. There's a person. Sorry. So you press this button and the traffic stops for you, and you go like a queen. I'm just kidding. It is the rule that you have to follow here. So the signal that you see there, it will tell you to start walking, and then you start walking. and everybody stops for you so cool right and we are done with our 
And with the banking stuff, it wasn't that boring. We made really nice friends there. The advisor there was really nice. She explained everything to us from A to Z, which we are going to share with all of you all. And regarding the credit cards, we have already applied. We should have that in place within a week's time. And now we are going to head out after having something because we really haven't had anything since morning and we are quite hungry. So let's just grab some coffee. We'll go home and uh, take some rest because I'm feeling a little dizzy. And after that, we are going to head out and gonna get something really special which we were eyeing for like last two years. And now that it is happening, it is so special. Um, if you wanna know what it is, just stay tuned and I'm going to share everything about it with you. Let's go and grab some coffee first. The night is young and so are we So maybe you should leave with me The night is young and so are we, baby The night is young, so let's have some fun If you love me right, yeah This could be the summer of our lives now, honey Give it to me like you know you should now, baby This could be... What are you gonna have? Maybe something hot. Okay, I'll have a cold coffee. Okay. I know it is curvy, but it is the best coffee I've ever had. Dark chocolate, my taste. Mm. Game for it anytime. Anywho, we are here to talk about some interesting stuff. I told them that we made like really good friends in Scotia. Yes, we did. Uh, the lady, the girl rather, she explained us everything from A to Z. So we are going to share our experience with you while transferring our money from India to Canada in Scotia. So let's get started. Right. So let's first talk about cash. How much was it? So we carried about $6,000 in cash and the rest of the amount we transferred from India to Canada to Scotia Bank account. So we opened our account online. Uh, I went to the Scotia Bank account, did the formalities and within 10 minutes, we got our wire transfer details to a secure email. Now when we talk about secure email, Scotia Bank is going to send you access to that secure email so that you can log in and sign up for it. It's pretty easy for a person who doesn't know anything about banking, which is a very bad habit. But it was quite easy. We both have had our accounts in ICICI back in India. We went there and told them that we want to get it done and it was done by wire transfer. Right. And like we went in the morning and it was sorted by evening. So that's like very easy peasy. And it was a matter of four working days that we received a confirmation from Scotia Bank that our money has been deposited in the bank account in Canada. Uh, that, is, that was also by email. And uh, there was a credit document that was given to us, which you can also take along with you. It is called, uh, what is it called? The POF. The POF, POF, yeah. POF, very famous POF document that you can take with you. Uh, so while you are like landing, they do ask you for these documents. So it's very important if you carry it with yourself. Right. So we were not asked about how much uh, money uh, do we have in our accounts. We were just asked for the cash thing. Okay, so that was it. Now let's talk about how our conversation at the bank went right now so we got ourselves enrolled with the preferred checking account yeah. at the Scotia Bank through the start right program for all the newcomers now the details about the program and the checking account is in the link in the description below so make sure you check it out um, also talking about the credit cards so I chose the American Express scene credit card for myself and I got myself visa scene card right visa scene credit card correct so uh, all in all we felt that these credit cards have more benefit and we chose these cards so that's that 
I think it was pretty easy. We chose Scotia and it was a very easy peasy process. If you would like to go ahead with it, like we said, it is all in the description box below. And we should take some rest now. And like I said, we are going to head out to Eden Center to get something right. which is like really, really special. And we'll see you in some time. And again, yeah. okay. all these considerations are our own. Yeah. Very so important. make sure you research before you finally Escape. get into a decision. Hi guys, so while Akanksha is resting it out, I thought I'll cover a very important topic which is the SIN number, your social insurance number. So in order to get the SIN number, you need to visit a Service Canada office. Uh, for us, we went to the Lawrence West uh, in North York. Uh, we reached there yesterday at 2.30 p.m. in the afternoon and we were very lucky because there were hardly 5 to 7 people in line. So we got our number in the next 30 minutes and max within one hour, we were out of the Service Canada office with our SIN number in hand. Now the documents that you need for the SIN number is your passport and your signed COPR copy. The SIN number is very important and it's very confidential. So make sure you do not give your SIN number to anybody. Uh, once you land here in Canada and get a number, you will start getting spam calls as well like we are getting now. Um, and they will ask for your SIN number. So please don't tell your SIN number to anyone, whosoever it is. You're only required to give your SIN number to your employer and other banking institutions uh, whenever they ask for. We are fresh now and uh, not feeling jet lag. That's a good thing. We figured why we fool around so little and we keep track of time being so serious idiots thinking it will matter keep me company downtown before the clock runs out sun is shining but the rain is welcome to friends are nearby don't need another view time is not on my mind but then it's you oh i love it when the love comes around and then i remember if you would have asked me like three minutes ago i was really really sad that i don't have much of to eat food here. We are at Eden Center and uh, I thought I just went to McD and only to find that they don't have veg options at all. So I had to buy some veggies with this really really bad coffee. Raghav had gone for a walk and then we saw there's a restaurant called Amaya. So we might get a veg platter there. They keep saying I'll be fine but how you know that I'll be there? When it feels like I'm lying every time Someone asks how it goes And I'll save the details that actually mean something Guys, there is a bummer We did not get the MacBook today Because apparently they did not have the model that we were looking for I'm kind of bummed right now But we'll go early in the morning tomorrow But then it's you Oh, I love it when the love comes around And then I remember all things must pass But I'm not gonna wake up, wake up I'm not ready, let me have another day Don't wake up, wake up Keep it steady, cause I'm happy I'm not gonna wake up No, no, not yet, whoa No, not yet, whoa No, no, not yet, whoa But I'm not gonna wake up Uh, it comes around 5 o'clock and the sun sets here usually around 8.30. I know, I'm also getting used to it, but it is really, really beautiful. You can see for yourself. Um, we have just come back from Ikea. We got some basic necessities, some glasses and some comforter, two pillow covers and everything. I will just link down the details for you uh, in the description box below, just in case you are interested to buy. But the showstopper, the stuff that we were waiting to buy, I'm literally fumbling because we were very excited. Yesterday we could not get it and I was so bummed. I did not even vlog this morning because I was like, what if we don't get it? So we were finally able to score the deal. The laptop is here. It's MacBook Pro 14 inches. 
and we were not having any laptops back in India. We realized this when it was my last working day, 15 July. Just when we were about to come here is when we realized, oh my God, we don't even have laptops. How will we apply for jobs or how will we start editing for YouTube? And then we both discussed because it is tad bit cheaper here. It's just tad bit, okay? We had to shell out a lot of money. Um, so we decided to buy it here and I was, I'm so excited and I can't wait to share the edited vlogs here because it is a kind of a beast in terms of editing and we had done a lot of research and uh, the budget that we wanted to buy in. Uh, so yeah, I'm so excited. I will just share the unboxing with you right after closing this vlog. And if you really like this vlog, please do give it a thumbs up and like this video, share with your peers. It will help me a lot and do subscribe to my channel. It will mean the world to me. Next vlog is coming up soon. It is going to be about Walmart or it's going to be Condito. I don't know. I haven't decided yet, but it's going to be very exciting. I can't wait to meet all of you all again. Thank you. Bye.